Hello friends, welcome to my new tutorial of Facebook API conversion and brown module expert in Google Analytics for tracking, Google Ads conversion tracking, Facebook pixel tracking, and LinkedIn tracking ADC. So if you are looking for all of this service, you will uh, you can email me or WhatsApp me. So let's get started. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to connect your Facebook pixel with your website through Google Tag Manager. So first of all, you have to install a Facebook pixel. Uh, to install a Facebook pixel, um, go to the business setting from your uh, Facebook Business Manager, and you can create pixel from here. Click on Data Sources and Pixel. If you click on add, you can click the picture from here. So uh, I have already uh, created a picture for this website. So let's go to that picture. This is the picture. This is the picture I have created. So uh, to connect uh, this picture uh, with this website you have to create a tag on google tag manager before creating tag you have to add a template which is called a uh, facebook archive so you have to add a tag template click on search gallery Click on the search bar and type here Facebook. You can see here Facebook picture by Facebook archive. Select this Facebook picture and add to workplace and add here. Now this Facebook picture archive has been added to this Google Tag Manager. Now I will create a tag. this is a uh, this this is a tag for page view and this is a tag uh, which connect uh, the picture id with your website so give it a name A B page view base code tag. Click on tag configuration and select this page picture. Now you have to paste here the pixel ID. So um, I will create a, a variable for this uh, pixel ID because otherwise I have to paste it here again and again. So let's create a variable so that we don't want to paste, copy and paste again and again because later we have to create event and we have to put that this pixel id every time so this is not this pixel id this pixel id uh, so create a variable for that Click on variable configuration and it will be constant. It will be constant. So I will copy this picture and go to contact manager and paste here. Now save this. Now 
add a trigger trigger will be all page save now and this is a page view the standard even page view so by default it is selected so submit this tag let's check whether uh, it's working or not whether the picture has connected with the website properly or not so for that connect to the debug mode because it shows you the right right thing shows you the proper thing now if we click on here you can see this pixel ID has been connected and I will also check uh, the event manager whether the event page view event are receiving or not so let's check so sometimes it takes time after configuring uh, Facebook pixel page view tag after configuring page view tag it takes time so i'll refresh it so you can see uh, the uh, event are receiving page view event so you can see here if you click on any page the page view will be part here you can see page view proceed You can see the page view uh, is receiving so thank you so much for watching my video thank you